Hello and welcome back. It is time for us to go into the glowing sea. And the first thing that I did is I got my Tesla armor and I went to Sanctuary. And I swapped it out for my X01 Enclave armor. The X02 is just, I don't know, I like it. And, uh, I'm going to keep using it, of course, but I just wanted my X01 for this particular mission. Also, I'm not wearing anything but um, Kellogg's outfit. I took off all my other armor. Uh, it's just, uh, you know, for weight, stuff like that. Uh, I figure whenever I'm on a mission that I'm in my power armor, I'm just going to wear Kellogg's outfit. And then whenever I'm not wearing my big ass power armor you know i'll have my full combat armor on and stuff it's just that it's so freaking heavy and um when i have when i'm in power armor and i have all that extra armor it does me no good um once you step out of the power armor is when that armor actually starts working for you but you know So we are going to head into the glowing sea. I came down to, we came down to Markwater. It's just me and Preston. I had to assign a bunch of people at Sanctuary. There were, there was a bunch of people up there that didn't have jobs. Um, why can't I go that way? There's no invisible barrier here. I'm right in the middle of the freaking map, dude. Huh. I never knew there was an invisible barrier here going into uh, the glowing sea. It makes no sense because <laughs> we're right in the middle of the freaking map. We have to go down here. Maybe... Um, they just don't have this section here done. I don't know how far. I can't remember how far I've come over before. I know I've been here. Uh, there's a crashed uh, vertebrate there and a big ass airliner. And there's a pyramid missile launching facility down here somewhere. But apparently I can't go that way to get where I want to go. That's all right. Now, if I happen across Somerville Place, that'll be a good thing, too. Because we can just pick up Somerville Place while we're down here. Ah, here's the fence that's... Okay. This fence is supposedly what tells you you can't go that way. Usually there's a death claw up here too. We need to be careful. He says just walking right up on it. Yeah, they've shut all that down. Okay. I gotcha. Night vision doesn't really help in fog. Uh huh. All right, now that with the lights, there's going to be we're we're coming up on ghouls, I believe, if I remember correctly. Somerville Place is on the other side of that, but that's full of ghouls. Oh, we're in danger. Yeah. 
This fool constantly throwing uh, Molotovs, man. Okay, maybe it wasn't ghouls. Maybe it's uh, maybe it's these large shrimp. I sure thought it was ghoul, so but maybe not. And it's getting darker. That's going to be better for us. And as I said, there's some rebuild place right there. I believe this is the southernmost, southernmost point into the glowing sea you can get. Whoa, look at all these barrels. Shit. That's weird. It's so close here. So this is Somerville place. As soon as we do that quest, we'll get this settlement and I'll, I'll turn it into an outpost and I'll put a re recruitment beacon up to get a few people in there, but I'm not really gonna, I'm not really gonna worry that much about it. Okay. I don't need to kill those guys. Okay, we need to turn. That's where we're going, right there. The glow. That's a death claw. gonna get a lot of death claw and rat scorpions up in here man all right let's get a little healing going just in case we get uh we get in a situation here. Um, Stingwing meat's good. We don't get a lot of stingwings. Yeah. 
Yeah, we're getting some rads here for sure. Okay, so what we need to do, I didn't bring any uh, rat away because that is the one that uh, makes you more susceptible to uh, to um, diseases and all that good stuff. So I've got um, some Project Cure All. I have one more of Megan's Wonder Cure. And then I've got one refreshing beverage. So hopefully that's going to keep us going. Now this is a church here full of ghouls. I want to get it on the map, although I don't want to go in the church yet. Yeah, it's it's full of ghouls in there, man. And most of the time I will go in there and clear them out. I just I'm not going to do it at the moment. Uh-oh. What's got us? The glowing one's still out there somewhere. There he is. And I'm not sure if we're in danger from the scorpions or from, uh, or the ghouls. Did I get something already? Really? Lethargy. Really? Oh boy. All right. Let's, uh, where's the wonder cure? There we go. I don't know where the other two are. All right, well, we're going to keep going. I want to discover the Super Duper Mart. Well, that wasn't what I wanted to do, but all right. appears to be all those yeah i was i did i um had second thoughts and i didn't want to use my um um my gauss rifle on a roach uh preston you almost got shot son shit all right
I'm not sure how true it is, but they do say that um, like rad scorpions and insects and stuff are more susceptible to uh, energy weapons than ballistic. Like I said, I don't know how much truth is in that uh, because I don't have that ability to let me look at them and see. Yeah, shoot it, Preston. Yeah, about time you pulled the trigger instead of throwing a fucking Molotov. All right, now is this on our map? I don't know if it shows up on the map or not. I don't think it does. Yeah, some things here just don't show up on the map. More Radix. Might should have brought more water. I don't have my recon on this either. Yeah, shoot it, Preston, shoot it. That's not all of them, there's another one over there. Oh, look, it's a death claw. Fighting a uh, scorpion, maybe? Fighting something? I don't know. Oh yeah, I forgot. I picked up the spray and pray. Ah, uh, dude. What the hell are you doing? Yeah, I found cricket and I went ahead and picked up the spray and pray because it's really useful. I may throw the death claw hand down. That's a uh, bone and leather, and I'm not really, not really needing that right now. But yeah, as part of the uh, commando perks that I have, the spray and pray, pray is really good. Um, and then once it gets closer, I can swap to the plasma and, it, you know, I still get my commando perks, uh, but it doesn't explode around me and piss everybody off. So, um, that was the thought, the thought process behind that. The spray and pray can get them at a distance and hopefully cripple them or, you know, something like that. All right. And here we are at our first goal. Dude, we're in the glowing sea. Stop right there, stranger. You approach Atom's holy ground. Why? State your purpose or be divided in his sight. Yeah, you don't want to do that. No. To merge with Atom, to be split in his infinite glory, or do you seek to tear down his followers? Looking for a dude named Virgil. Named Virgil. Virgil. Yes, we know this Virgil. Okay. I need to speak with you. What do you need of me, child? Virgil. I'm looking for someone named Virgil. Have you seen him? Yes, I know of him. What do you want with him? I just need some information from him. I see. In truth, this Virgil has caused some concern. Some believe his presence is an affront to Atom. 
Though he came here to trade with us on few occasions, we have had little other contact with him. It was quite clear he wanted to be left alone. You can find his son <laughs> beneath the crater, living in a cave. Maybe he just thought you needed to get out of radiation and take a bath and fix that shit on your forehead. Maybe. Hmm? All right. There's usually a guy here that sells stuff. Of course, I may be sleeping now. Yeah, they're sleeping. So we're not going to worry about it. We can always come back to trade with them. The real children of Adam we want to trade with are in Far Harbor, though. That's where we're really going to start getting some good shit in Far Harbor. Yeah, let's just walk through that big ass radiation right there. And I usually just hop around the mountain like this. I need to get rid of some bullets anyway. That's a lot of my weight. That was a legendary too. Where'd he go? Just in case he pops up right in front of me. What the hell, dude? Personal bubble? You got hit. Okay. Where'd the other one go? that up there that's the nuclear power plant there's a dead claw up there uh it's also a quest item once i pick up the postman's body for a different mod there's a quest item up there uh and there's a lot of work to actually be done in the glowing sea we just have to get in here and, you know, get some of these landmarks discovered and then we can get some of these jobs done.
No, human beings are the worst menace in the Commonwealth, my friend. Human beings. Yeah, human beings are the worst ever. I'm just looking for information on the Institute. The Institute? So, they did send you, didn't they? You working with Kellogg. Relax, big guy. Kellogg won't be coming after you. He's dead. Dead? He's dead. Don't you lie to me. I'm not lying. I killed him myself. Did you? Kellogg was ruthless. There's a reason the Institute used him to do their dirty work for so many years. I knew he was sent in for me. Tried to prepare for it. But I still wasn't sure I'd make it. And so you... You killed him, eh? Then what do you want with me? I know you were part of it. And... You escaped. They sent Kellogg to kill you. How the hell do you know any of that? No, it doesn't matter. I'm not going back. I can't go back. Look at me. Why are you even here? What do you want? Relax. I just need to know how to get in there. Wait, what? Are you serious? You want to get into the Institute? Are you insane? Never mind how nearly impossible that is. Even if you were to succeed, it'd almost certainly end in your immediate death. What reason could you possibly have for taking that kind of risk? I'm trying to find my son. The Institute kidnapped him. Oh. Oh no. I had no idea. I'm sorry. The Institute has taken people from the Commonwealth in the past. If your son is one of them, I can understand why you'd want to get in there. I can help, but I'm going to need something in return. You help me, then I'll help you. All right. If I help you, you're going to do something for me. Before I was forced to leave, I was working on a serum to reverse this mutation. It could return to normal. You understand? So if you get in there, I need you to find it in my old office and bring it to me. I think that's pretty reasonable in exchange for helping you. All right? Let's talk details. First things first. You know how synths get in and out of the Institute? Yeah, they use some sort of teleporter? Well, well. Not many know about it. Pretty closely guarded secret. You've certainly done your homework. It's commonly referred to as the molecular relay. I don't understand all the science behind it, but it works. Dematerializes you in one place, rematerializes you in another. I'm sure it sounds crazy, but it's a reality. The relay is the only way in and out of the No, it's not. Only going to have to use it. Now, have you ever seen an institute courser? No, never heard of him. Another secret of the institute. Trust me, 
It's good that you haven't found out the hard way. Coursers are institute synths designed for one purpose. They're hunters. Operations go wrong, a synth goes missing, and a courser is dispatched. They're very good at what they do, and you're going to have to kill one. Let's go. Just point me in the right direction. Well, I suppose your enthusiasm counts for something. Every and I've killed a thousand things in this game. Coursers don't scare me. <laughs> one down. I can tell you where to start and give you some help finding one, but you'll have to do the dirty work. Okay, let's get to work. Right. The primary insertion point for coursers is in the ruins of CIT, directly above the Institute. So you'll want to head there. Now, the relay causes some pretty heavy interference all across the EM spectrum. You've got a radio on that pip boy, right? When you get to the ruins, tune it to the lower end of the band and listen in. You'll be able to hear the interference. Follow the signal, and it'll lead you to a courser. Then, you just have to not get killed. <laughs> the odds aren't in your favor here. But if you do make it, remember what I said about the serum. I need it badly. I... I really do hope you find what you're looking for. Okay, so that's Virgil. <laughs> and there's Preston bitching about something smelling. But here's a Tesla magazine for us. That's 5% more critical damage. Um, hello, fat boy. Preston just gonna make us up at home on the chemistry station. Okay, so we've got uh, we've got something in front of us now. We got to go kill a courser. Shouldn't be a big deal, uh, even though he uses a stealth boy. Uh, I'm going to use my last Megan's Wonder Cure here. And I'm going to call it here. We're at 33 minutes. I'm going to I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. We got the Virgil. We got the quest. We got to go kill a Courser. Uh, I'll come back when we start tracking the Courser. And uh, we'll see how well we do there. So for right now, thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you guys on the next one.